Okay, so let's solve this problem. Find the equation of parabola with vertex at 4, 1 and equation of directrix y equals to 4. Then graph the parabola. Now first, we need to graph the parabola. Now, from the given vertex 4, 1 and equation of directrix y equals to 4. Take note that uh, directrix is always at the back of the parabola. So therefore, our parabola opens downward. Directrix at the back of the parabola. So our formula now, now observe that our uh, parabola passes through two points on the x-axis. This one, so two points on the x-axis. Therefore, our formula, the x squared formula. So the x squared formula, that's x minus eight squared. Now since uh, opens downward or opens to the negative y. So, 4p now is negative. So, this is the formula that we're going to use. The x minus 8 squared equals negative 4p, then y minus k. To solve for uh, p, so that's the distance from vertex to directrix. So, distance from the vertex to the directrix, that's our p. So, just count. So, in counting, this is how to count. So, start on the next point. So, 1, 2, 3. Again, Start on the next point when counting, so 1, 2, 3. Okay, so therefore our P is equals to 3. Now, for H and K, so since in our parabola vertex is H and K, and we have given vertex 4 and 1, so H now is 4 and K is 1. Okay. So, we're going to use these uh, values to solve for the equation of parabola using this formula. So, x minus h, that's 4. Then, negative 4 times p, that's 3. And, y minus k, k is 1. Then, simplify. So, x minus 4 squared, then negative 4 times 3, that's 12. Then, y minus 1, and this is our standard form. So, this is the standard equation of our parabola. Now, to solve for the uh, general form, so we just have to expand the whole equation. So, first, expand x minus 4 to the power 2. So, we have two ways on how to expand this equation. So, we have the FOIL and the SMS. So, start with the FOIL. So, we just have to rewrite x minus 4 to the power 2 twice. So you have x minus 4 times x minus 4. Then apply the FOIL method. So x times x, then x times negative 4, then negative 4 times x, and negative 4 times negative 4, that's 16. Then combine like terms. So negative 4 minus negative 4, that's negative 8x. So this is the answer. Now, for SMS, so first, s, that's the square of the first term. So square of x squared, that's x squared. Then m, that's multiply. So you just have to multiply the whole equation. So 2 times x times negative 4, that's negative 8x. Then the last s, that's the square of the second term. So negative 4 squared, that's a positive 16. Then you combine. So we have x squared minus 8x plus 16. So therefore, x minus 4 to the power 2 is uh, x squared minus 8x plus 16. Then on the right side, just do the uh, distributive property. So negative 12 times y, that's negative 12y. Then negative 12 times negative 1, that's positive 12. Then next, equate the whole equation to 0. So all terms uh, on the right side transpose to the left. So negative 12y transpose to the left, that's positive 12y. This one, positive 12 transpose to the left, it's negative 12. Then you combine like terms, so positive 16 and negative 12, so we have x squared minus 8x plus 12y, then this one, positive 16 minus 12, that's positive 4. So this is now our general form.